non-halal restaurants will have to place signs indicating so in the future. Tourism and Culture Minister Datuk Sri Nazri Aziz says, being a Muslim country, it was only logical to inform the people, particularly Muslim tourists, which restaurants were non-halal and not the other way around. And only those who do not serve halal food will have to put there, we are non-halal restaurant. Instead of, you know, in a, in, in a Muslim country, why should we uh, advertise and say that we serve halal food? It's a Muslim country. So what we want to do now is that, you know, we want to make sure that every uh, Muslim can come to this country and feel uh, secure that all restaurants are halal. Those who are not serving halal food will have to put the label non-halal. Then the Muslim will know. <coughs> Majority of Malaysians are Muslim. And, uh, you know, restaurants, if they don't have Muslim coming to their restaurant, let's say it's a, it's a restaurant run by non-Muslim, they have to serve Muslim food, otherwise 65% of the market, they will lose. Because we won't go to the restaurant if it's not halal. So it only makes sense for a uh, businessman who opens uh, a restaurant, they have to ensure that their food is halal. Because 65% of this country are Muslims. Restaurants operated by non-Muslims should also strive to be halal in order to keep up with market demands. He told reporters after giving a keynote address at the opening of Joint Seminar on Islamic Tourism. Nazri says, although the move was not mandatory yet and no time frame given, the process of getting non-halal restaurants to indicate so had already started. Earlier in Nazri's speech, he says Malaysia, Brunei and Indonesia should capitalise together on the increasing trend of Muslim visitors in the region. He says in conjunction to the Visit Malaysia Year 2014, Muslim tourists would comprise about 25% of total visitors. Meanwhile, Crescent Rating founder and CEO Fazal Bahardin says, for the fourth consecutive years in the row, Malaysia is voted the top Muslim holiday destination in the world.